take your mower, put the handle in neutral, push it out. Come to the rear of the mower, unhook your shock and your linkage. This one's kind of snug. Come back to the front of the mower, put the handle all the way forward. Step back to the rear. Check and make sure this bar is is vertical. If it's if it's leaned out in this direction towards the rear of the mower or leaned too far forward, uh, you're gonna it's gonna bind up as you're driving. So make sure this bar is almost perfectly vertical. If it's out of alignment, move this center pin here. Thread this in. As you take this out, you can move this bar in either direction. Get it spin this till it lines up vertically. Reinstall it. But with your handle in the forward position, hold this, pull it all the way back. See if this lines up. If it doesn't line up, thread it until it does line up correctly. Too far. As it slides in easily, reinstall your shock and your linkage and your pin. This is gonna put your mower at max speed on the right hand side. Lock your handle back into neutral position. Come to the left hand side with the left hand handle locked into the neutral position. Uninstall your gas shock and your linkage and check to see if this linkage lines up. If this linkage does not line up in the neutral position, with the handle in the neutral position, adjust this linkage until it lines up perfectly with the hole and then reinstall. Drive the mower to see if the mower drives straight and it should not creep in this position. If you have a creep on one side or the other you can adjust, I would leave the right hand side as is because it's at max speed and adjust the left hand side to compensate. If you uninstall your shock, again, if you're, let's say your left side is too fast, uninstall your shock again and your linkage. If it's too fast, the left side, if it's pulling to the right, thread this in and it's going to keep this bar from going max tilt. So as you thread in, it's going to shorten the throw of this bar. If it's going too slow, thread it out one turn, reinstall, and drive it. And one turn at a time or what would be a half turn technically and see if and then drive the mower until it starts to track straight you shouldn't have any creepage and the mower should drive straight and should be nimble